Why do you think the show has stood the test of time? I don't know, but every single person asks me that question. I, I, loyal fans. I mean, I don't know. You know, it speaks to it speaks to something. I, we're always lucky to have incredible writers and incredible cast, and um, I think that this show has heart and soul, and everybody loves a good cry. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, you've worked on the show for so many years. Do you think that, like, and it's been so successful? Do you think your husband is excited for the day that maybe you're like it finally stops and you get to like spend a little more time with him at all? You know, I have to say, um, I am very, very lucky. And as yeah. I've said before, um, I'm in a very nice position where I get to spend a lot of time with my family. Um, ABC is a great partner, and they have allowed me the space and grace to be able to balance my home life and my work life. And like I said, anytime a woman has that kind of power and control over her own body and her own life, that's a sweet spot to be in. So I'm, I'm, very, I'm very lucky to not only have the fans, but to have partners like Shonda and ABC who understand uh, how important the rights of women are. Indeed, indeed. I also, I love your podcast, and I love when you were talking about Jesse Williams and his play. Thank and like you. like the predicament. Did yes. you end up go seeing him? Ever? Of course I saw him. Of course I did. Take Me Out. It's fantastic. Everybody, if you haven't gone to see Take Me Out, go see it. Okay. It's um, also a really good story worth telling. Okay. Yes. Were you co covering your eyes in that part that, you know, where you get a little nude? Or you know, I have to say, I was a little anxious about the, the nudity and seeing my, my, he's like my brother. But to be honest, the story is so important, you know? Um, there aren't that many. I don't think there's any. I may be speaking out of turn. I'm not yeah. a huge baseball fan. I okay. don't think there's any major league baseball yeah. fans that are out, okay. completely out. Right. Um, and and this play was written, I think, in 1982. So, you know, anytime we can have a major league baseball player, a story about a major league baseball player coming out as gay, and the, everybody needs to see these stories. The stories are important to tell. Indeed, indeed. Yeah. And, and, and before you go real quick, I love that you spoke, You um, supported Catherine recently. Why do you think it was important for you to st stand up for her now? Um, I've always, I've always stood up for her, and I have a, a, a deep, deep love and respect for everybody who's been a part of Grey's Anatomy. It would not be the show that it is without everybody who's contributed. I have a lot of love for everybody. Hey dolls, we have a new show for you to keep up with all things Kardashian. Every week we're going to be breaking down the drama, the relationships. Check it all out right here. New episodes drop every Thursday. Yay. Oh, <laughs> not the best high five, yeah. but we're good co-hosts.